College of the Atlantic is welcoming a renowned artist and his installation celebrating Maine's nature, stone, and the winding road of life. Katie Sharp takes us there. There's big construction going on in Bar Harbor, but not building up, more building in. Nature for me is not the thing that's outside of a city in the woods, it's in everything, in me, in the city, in the rock, the buildings, the wood, the table, the chair, the floor, and the woods. But I follow the land, and that is the theme that connects all of these works together, and particularly the granite and the stone. You know, when I look at uh, the walls that run through New England landscape, uh, it, it, it's, it's a very poignant thing. Renowned artist Andy Goldsworthy is installing his latest piece, Road Line. It will stretch 1,500 feet and connect a curb on the Eden Street sidewalk nearly to Frenchman Bay. The project is already drawing a crowd. Even Martha Stewart stopped by to check it out. Lines, you're going to be seduced by them. But one that is a road, one that is actually something that people walk along, travel along, journey along. It's such a resonance with the passage of the stone from when it was formed inside the earth and then come to the surface and quarried and then sent off on journeys. Previously, it was sent off on ships from here. So the idea of fluidity and movement. And I think that connection between people's lives and that stone is what this work is about. Essentially, that's uh, also what the students do. They, they pass through this place and I hope that when they leave whenever they step by a curb they'll remember being here in their own journeys and perhaps entice folks to take the road less traveled I imagine some visitor to Mount Desert Island walking down the multi-use pathway and the curb is going to be on the right and all of a sudden the curb is going to subversively bank to the left and cut at you know flush with the with the pavement but cut across and each person that crosses that is going to look to their left and say to themselves what's going on here like and where does that go and I hope they might say hey let's follow it. Katie Sharp WABI TV 5 News Bar Harbor.